Let's now shift focus to Africa. Somalia is suffering from the impact of a climate crisis it hasn't, it has done almost nothing to create. That's what United Nations Chief Antonio Guterres has said. He made the statement after visiting a camp in Baidua in southwest Somalia. The devastating drought in the country, which killed 43,000 people last year, is now threatening to push Somalia into a famine. The disaster has displaced around 1.4 million Somalis, with women and children making up 80% of them. The UN chief has appealed to the international community for more aid. Urgent humanitarian assistance is needed for some 8.3 million Somalis. And we must now act to prevent a catastrophe. Adding to the woes of Somalis, rising food prices are leading to more cases of hunger and malnutrition. Vulnerable communities have been pushed to the verge of starvation. People have also been displaced due to fighting between Al-Shabaab and an, an Al-Qaeda affiliate and government forces. Despite five consecutive poor rainy seasons, adequate international aid has not reached the people of Somalia. 2023 humanitarian response plan, which seeks 2.6 billion US dollars, is just 15% funded. When famine looms, this is totally unacceptable. The international community must step up and dramatically increase the volume of funds to support Somalia in this moment of difficulty. The crisis could worsen in the coming months, as it is expected that around 6.6 .6 million Somalis may face high levels of acute food insecurity between April and June.